A while ago, I talked about the challenges of being a multi-passionate. Today, it's time to take a look at the benefits, a subject that is a lot more fun. If you like what you're seeing here, consider subscribing. If I get more questions on the subject, I will definitely make more videos about it. I have made a little list about the benefits that I could think of. It's by no means a complete list, as nobody can think of everything. If you want to add something or ask a question, do it in the comments. Let's get started on that list. You're interesting. You have lots of conversation topics. You know a lot of different things. People can ask you about stuff if they need help with something. And usually you can give them an answer, provided they know what you're interested in. <laughs> For example, if someone asks me about sewing or photography or painting, drawing, things like that, I can usually give them an answer. And the same goes for a problem on their website or something to do with using graphic software. So you are a lot more interesting if you have a lot of interests. You're curious. And uh, curiosity is not a bad thing, it's really, really good, because it you figure out things more, you learn a lot of new stuff, you're curious about people, so you get to know people. The next on the list is you're a creative thinker. You always have new ideas. This can, of course, go too far, but you can always come up with an idea. You have a lot of choices. You don't have to do the same thing day in, day out. There's always something new and exciting to learn. Skillshare is a real death trap. <laughs> Pinterest too, for that matter. It's so easy to get caught up in everything you want to learn, everything you want to try. But it's really good that you're willing to learn, that you have all these interests because you can, you get to work your brain. It's good for your brain <laughs> to learn new things. You have a lot of fun things to do. It doesn't matter what your passions are. Because you think they're fun, you always have a lot of fun things to do. Uh, exploring all these passions also builds a lot of different skills. This means that you're able to do most things yourself because you can figure out how to do it. If you don't know it, you'll learn how to do it. And then you do it. You can also combine all these talents into something completely new that the world has never seen before. Think about that for a minute. You can create something totally unique. Wouldn't that be fun? If you prefer to have a regular job, you can find a job that is actually fun for you to do. A job that you actually like doing. And I know a lot of people don't have that option. That's the short list that I created of all the benefits of being a multi-passionate. There are a lot more, but as I said, those are the ones that I could come up with right now. If you want to see some names of some successful multi-passionates, you can head on over to the blog I've linked to in the description where I have summed up both the challenges, the benefits, and I've listed up some names of successful multi-passionates. And there are also some links to some of them which have good resources on the subject, plus some advice for fellow multi-passionate people. I hope you like this video and that you will stick around. Subscribe, share it with your friends. I'll be back next week. Bye bye.